you may have seen already posted is the new Q&A sessions that we've got coming up and I'm going to endeavour to make sure that we are covering those every Friday. So live at 11 will become a regular Friday kind of grab your coffee and join in for a 30 minute chat. Um, I'm really excited because I've got fantastic people joining me for those chats for the first four sessions and I'm just going to keep building on that. So the first session is going to be with uh, Sarah Kerrigan of Jellyfish Training and um, she's going to be talking all things Facebook advertising and Sarah is a fantastic, fantastic trainer. So her knowledge is vast. So if you've got any questions, it's an absolute joy to have Sarah part as part of this group. So be sure that if you have got questions and you're thinking about Facebook advertising, you've got any questions about Facebook advertising, segmentation, targeting, etc, etc, bring them to that session because um, it, it's going to be a fantastic session. The next week we're going to have Vinny, Vinny Haywood from VH Digital and he's also the um, owner of a fantastic group called The Content Blueprint and again Vinny is absolutely a master in digital he's won he does he does all these kind of tech hub battles and things and he, he goes around the world doing stuff so I mean he's an amazing talent an amazing knowledge base and uh, he's going to be on board and we're going to be picking his brains he's going to be sharing stuff about content and not just about creating the content, but how do you, once you've created a video, once you've created uh, a blog, once you've created uh, an image or a piece of content that you want to share, you know, instead of sharing it once, how do you repurpose that and how do you get more and more people utilizing and seeing that content so extending your reach but without massive effort you know so being really smart with your content marketing and that is what Vinny is going to bring to that session so really excited about that hello joe oh my goodness hi joe wonderful to see you my love Mwah. big kiss known joe since i was two years of age so uh, she's a long, long, long time friend. And uh, Dan, hello Dan, thanks for tuning in. Uh, I didn't announce I was going live here, but I just, I'm, I'm going to do this a bit more impromptu more often, so I do appreciate you tuning in. So hi, and thanks for sending those waves. Um, who else is coming up on the Q&As? Yeah, David Taylor. Now, some of you will know that I've written some books. I've got a new book coming out in May, uh, Get Social. And the first couple of books that I wrote were with David Taylor. David Taylor and I trained We've trained thousands of people, literally thousands of people. We've been around the world, we've been through Europe. We have trained thousands of businesses from all different shapes and sizes, uh, people with all different levels of expertise, from senior directors and CEOs to corp communications teams to uh, leadership teams within, you know, uh, PwC. We've trained, we've done it, we've, we've spoken at the Oxford Farming Conference from, you know, talking about how farmers are utilising social media, right through to more digital as aspects over in the digital, um, you know, Shoreditch Festival and, and various bits and pieces. So David is somebody I trust emphatically about what is happening with social and I'm delighted that David is going to be joining us over on Social Souls. He is going to be talking about content again but slightly different uh, to Vincent, well very different to what Vinny's going to be talking about. David's going to be sharing stuff around um, how you cure, how you get that content, how you keep that content reservoir topped up because we all know that on social content is such a big part of, of what we're doing as part of that story that we're sharing and that content can be many things it can be written word it can be visual it could be graphical it can be video um, and how do you get the right content for your objectives and if that's within an organization that me might mean that you've got lots of different people sharing different points of view so you might be drawing from your customer services team from your HR team from your finance team from the leadership team from your marketing team you, you know there may be very different aspects of, of what is going going on within that business and getting different people aligned almost creating your own little newsroom so that you've got these mini journalists out there reporting whether they're reporting directly and broadcasting or whether they're bringing it back to a central hub where then you've got this content to show 
to share. That is what David's going to talk about. So, he, you know, he's going to talk about even if you're a one man band, that's still, you know, that newsroom may be you. It may be you and, and only you or it may be a whole team of people. So regardless of your situation, there's going to be some real gems in that session as well. And then the other session I've got lined up so far is with Vicky, Vicky Mills. Vicky actually worked with Carvel Creative for a long time. She, she still does uh, do various uh, bits of assignments with us. And, um, but she is now marketing director over at Incipio Group. Now, Incipio Group are a really creative and entrepreneurial um, bunch of millennials, really. And, and they have been creating some fantastic... Uh, restaurants and and not just restaurants but restaurant concepts like these pop-up rooftop bars uh, that you may have seen there was one on the rooftops of the BBC in, in White uh, White City there's um, there's been one in Paddington Station at Paddington Basin um, and Pergola is you know these rooftop bars uh, is a, a rooftop restaurants is a relatively new thing in the UK I've been to a couple of them and they are fantastic and Vicky's going to share just how important social media has been in the development and growth of those brands because it's a relatively new fertile business but it's doing stupendously well I mean absolutely fantastically well and uh, you know it just goes from strength to strength to strength and social has been a really big part of that so she's going to give us the grassroots insight into what they did how they've used social how they continue to use social to grow and develop a, a, a startup basically a fast growth startup uh, and how social media has uh, supported that and contributed to that so you can see why I'm excited with just those four sessions we've got some real knowledge some real expertise so if you've got questions questions about content questions about how social media and digital can help you really fast track and develop and extend and expand your marketing activity to help you grow your business you've got questions about Facebook advertising you've got questions about where do you get your content? What is the best content? What should I be doing? And, and how, you, how can you then optimize and leverage and repurpose that content? Got questions about any of that stuff, then those sessions are going to be absolutely pure gold. And I really encourage you to get on board with those. I encourage you to share, uh, you know, the promotions that we're going to be doing around those sessions to get as many eyeballs there as possible, because they're going to be really, really valuable. And the more questions we have, the more valuable that's going to be. So if you've got questions, post them, post them, post them. You don't you tune in on the day and ask those questions. But even better, if I've got some questions uh, to prep and, and be able to take to those sessions uh, and then you, you can all tune in as well. So uh, that's what I wanted to say today. As you can see, I've got lots on my list, so I'm going to be cracking on. Uh, I can tick this box off and I will look forward to catching up with you. Not tomorrow. I may do some streaming tomorrow. I'm over a fantastic event tomorrow which is all about looking at how uh, businesses grow and develop and tools and resources to assist with that. All of that knowledge I'll be bringing back to Carville, back to Social Cells, so who knows, I may even go live tomorrow but from Central London at that event. So thanks for tuning in, thanks Joe. thanks Dan, nice to have you watching. Um, thanks to everybody else who watches this later, please share Please encourage people to join in with Social Souls. I want to grow this group. The more people we have in this group that need support and want to help one another, and the more pros and experts we have in this group that can support and share. And you don't have to be a pro and expert to support and share. You know, we're lucky we've got some of those people in this group. But you know, your own experiences are just as valid because the whole thing with social is, you know, what works, what works for you and what you found and, and how things are working. And the same with digital, you know, you'll have your own stories, you'll have your own tactics. So don't be afraid to share, don't be afraid to ask questions. This is that safe, happy place for us all just to, to ask questions. I ask questions, you know, we don't all know everything that's going on. And that's because there are no stupid questions. That's exactly why Social Souls exists. So I look forward to keeping tuned in. I look forward to catching up with you. I look forward to seeing more of you in on the lives. And I look forward to more of you asking those all important questions. Bye for now. And thanks. Bye.